Nigerian man beat up wife. Wife called police and the husband reported his wife to the, the nursing and midwifery council, NMC. That is wife international English language testing system. Result she submitted to the home office was fake. NMC commenced investigation and found her beauty withdraw her from the register. Husband and wife are now back in Nigeria as I speak, guys. You were there. I was not there. Check the record. Wait now. You I was not there. I was not there. Check the record. I was not there, but you were there. I, but I was not there. I was not there. Greetings, global audience, and welcome once again to another video that I will call advice. Yes. You guys know I always say Nigerians, we know the hear word. Nigerians, we too, they overdo. And Nigerians, we know they agree, agree. Yes. Story time. Once upon a time, in the lives of a Nigerian couple, Mr. and Mrs. You understand? Definitely they started their love life back home in Nigeria before the woman got certificate of sponsorship to come to the Europe, UK to be precise, to work as a nurse, NHS nurse. And simply because they are married, you know, the UK doesn't like separating families. You get me? By so doing, the man had to come as a dependent of the wife so that they can continue their Benmati Jambori that they stopped in Nigeria. Is it not a good thing? Yes, now. That's what it's supposed to be. But Nigerians will be saying, would they do anyhow, anywhere we go, would they show ourselves? They will not drop all those their nonsense and ingredients attitude, bad character and behavior back home in Africa. A country that is not even civilized, that is not known for anything good, apart from uh, 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 bad, bad things. Now they know our country, but that is by the way. Could you believe that this Nigerian couple came all the way from Nigeria to Obodo Yibo, United Kingdom, and they start to show themselves again? Fine and good. There is no home or marriage, even relationship friendships even at work you understand that things go smoothly there must be little goes back sometimes it might even go extreme and that is what happened in this family's life could you believe that they had an altercation which escalated into the united kingdom police because they are always there for peace and order they are always there you understand to make sure homes are unified but when those bars don't they enter panel beating assault they're not they take and play for this country where we deal you dare not smack your child you dare not spank your animal whether it be it's pussycats lizards rats and dog whatever as far as an animal that is under your roof that you are accommodating as a pet you know you do not burn you if you know you are not man enough or strong enough or emotionally balanced to take care of the animal call them for phone they are willing to come and rescue that animal adopt the animal take the animal good care let alone human being you understand that is how civilized the united kingdom is no, they're not, there's no man born of a woman. So you go raise hand, make you want smack your pekin, or you draw in jaw as they draw a jaw. Not my jaw fat, so this jaw yen win for Nigeria. You understand? At my our ear, they, they drum up, take and pick, walk come up for ground with the ear when we small that time. Raise them up, all those nonsense. What they happen for Obodo Ibo? Nine this wife and the husband get those bars. The wife called police then the man say okay eh, you didn't say you they wise you they call police for me oh yeah let's see now then you will tell 
the home office of how you got the certificate that brought you to the UK. Now, so this international English language will they take? Now, in the talk, say the woman do magomago puts, we carry and come abroad. You see why I always say sleeping with your enemy, eh? When you don't know, say, yes, yeah, this person are your enemy. And why I will still say that word secrecy in the dictionary, if it's not existing, or you will not put out for them. Nothing like secrets. I have a good friend that can keep my secrets. My husband can keep my secrets. My wife can keep my secret because she, she, she knows how to give me jamboree wear wear. Let your secret die with you. If you release any secret to anybody, question of time, it will be exposed. Look at what happened to this couple now. You understand? Fraudulent activity. Now, big crime. For everywhere, when you go forge documents or you go do impersonation, they know they take a year, the year and nine, many years imprisonment. Now, in this husband go report home office. Home office is an organization. You understand? The people will be saying at the nine day determine whether they go give you visa or not and then they determine whether you be you go stay for their country or whether they go to repatriate you back as the man told them what the wife did now nah, oh yeah then take digger digger do investigation say ah now nah, so you be oh yeah look at two they go back penny wise pound foolish and so you broke cause now you think you want to do me so my own pound of flesh now nah, go do you more by telling home office that ah you don't be waiting then things say you'll be oh. too often and then they can't regard this so you're not gonna go back to our fatherland we don't want this kind of people for our country we're not gonna spoil our country we not see on our lives eh everything now we're not going to talk talk blah 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 people know they keep their mouth moot anymore people know they padlock their mouth people don't keep secret to themselves there are certain things that is not pleasant to the ears you understand? Let it die with you. Yes. Let it die with you because there's nothing like best friend. There's nothing like best husband. There's nothing like my husband love me. Because when the love sour, opposite of love, now hate. The hatred. You know when you hate something, you hate that thing with passion. There are some people that hate to see one's face every morning. They don't even want to know, say, the person that exists. They don't want to hear that thing. They are ready to go to Eshun to eliminate the person from planet Earth. Whereas the person not do them anything, no. It could be from family members, it could be from friends, it could be from extended relative. They don't just want your existence. That's so it be. So the, the pound of flesh where the man talks, okay, my wife, you just say you will come embarrass me, eh? I go tell you, say, eh, a wicked. Wickedness is my name. Look at what he did to the wife. At the end of the day, bye bye to Nigeria. You now see on herself. Thought is time telling children, say how many times on go do now before I go get sense. This story keeps happening over and over again. People they watch them, but they will still they do them. And let's not forget that this couple that they live both bad life from abroad, Nigeria, where they're from come before they enter Obodo Ibo. Yes. That is why as a cuckoo come here, the table let come cuckoo break. Then the woman, too, you made foolery of yourself because if you know you will do such a thing. By calling a uh, Olokpa on your husband, if you're not going to bring the man come, because now they fight for Africa before. There is no two ways. The marriage is not balanced. It's imbalanced. It is shake like Shakespeare. You understand? So, nah, nah, and if they repatriate or deport people like this, eh, then they give them long-term ban. Bam, they go stamp them. They don't go enter the country for a long time. And what about your formation for other countries? for forge now oyibo then they civilize in many are white wizard the way we get black with witch and wizard oyibo people own it now they'll be white owned they use their own do good immediately impute your data for anywhere around the oyibo country they go see say madam your information get killed you don't give yourself stigma for nigeria they for the country there they suffer eh NHS nurse for that matter, where people they find with Okokoro. Ah, I made them come, come pay them better money for you. Now you get opportunity because you say your mouth not they keep secrets. Eh? Una can go disgrace on herself. Make una continue. You hear the smell.